home turf. So it's really important that we showcase why we are the best of the best in Mississippi. Come on, y'all. All of y'all got y'all clothes to put back on? Jackets, pants, whatever you need. Today, the baby dancing dolls are competing in the field show division, and the dancing dolls are only doing stands so that they can make sure that they're up to their game and ready to compete. Y'all, the big girls come over here. Put your bags up on your table in front. It's game day. We need to kill it. I'm, like, ready. I'm ready for the Tiger race. It's very rough week. I'm just so ready to see who win. Who gonna win? Who gonna win? Come on. All right, ladies. Come on in. Let's make it work. All the way from Memphis, Tennessee. We gotta make it hot. Show these girls what we came to do. Everybody needs to be smiling, enthused. Make it work all the way through. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. Get ready for the competition. Get ready for the competition. Come on, come on, come on, come on. You don't know what you're doing. You only got one clutter. Hey. hey I'm surprised to see Sanjay and JJ at the competition specifically because of what happened the night before. Um, Selena comes barging into practice because Sanjay gets cut. And when I told her that I didn't want to see her at the competition, I didn't think that Sanjay was going to come. I was just wondering if it's okay if she come back up on the squad. I know Selena, she be acting crazy and everything. And me spending that money like I do, baby, I want to make sure that my baby uh, continue to dance because this is what she really want to do. Me, Selena, even though we're separated, we're raising our children together. I all Always gotta try to be the one to smooth things over based off her nonsense, but daddy gotta do what the daddy gotta do. <laughs> well, Selena is gonna have to step back because I can't deal with that. This is every week. She's handicapped for Sanjay. She's not pushing her. Really and truly, the parents have to understand that they hurt the kids when they act like they do. And she and hurts they me too, baby. Right? So she I'm hurts sure. me in my pocket. You know what I'm saying? I do understand where you come from. And she has to trust me as a coach. I know what I'm doing. JJ is very, very open minded. JJ is not gonna cut corners for Sanjay. He's gonna push her because he knows that she can be great at what she's doing. I know that I have a lot of work to catch up with the girls. So I I've been practicing, and if you would have me, I would like to come back. I'm going to have to be the adult, and I'm going to have to tell my mom what she can and cannot do, and she better listen. But, Sandra, you, you do have a lot that you have to work on, and every week I can tell you're getting better, but it's not be halfway. It's with the stance, it's all or nothing. You have to know the all. We DD for L for life. <laughs> yeah, she's fine. She can go up there and sit with the rest of the girls. She's good. Okay, that sounds good. Okay. Right. Sanjay got a bright future, and I don't want none of that taken away from her. I want her to prosper and blossom. I don't want nothing stopping and getting in the way of that. Okay, y'all, hey, listen. The Tigerettes are here, so y'all need to make sure that y'all go after them. Any one thing could cost us a competition, no mistakes. The Tigerettes are feeling like, hey, we beat them once, we beat them twice. It doesn't matter at this point. I'm feeling like this win is a must because they're second-guessing themselves and second-guessing their captain, and I don't need them to do that. And y'all need to trust y'all quarterback because some of y'all I'm not feeling like y'all do. Y'all have anything y'all want to tell Kayla and say to her because she's the one that's got the lead? Nobody else got nothing to say, because if you don't have nothing to say, now, don't say nothing to her when it's over with. There's nothing that Kayla could have done more.